besties wow that sounds really really nice i think that's what we're gonna be using for this year so let's get into it <laughs> Hopefully these hair companies and nail companies will reach out to me and partner with me. I don't know. Let's just speak it into existence because that's part of the dream, part of the plan. Yeah, because we actually need to go and start having all this brand endorsement. So yeah. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Leanne and welcome back to life with Leanne Guys, I want to welcome you to my very first video of the year <laughs> I know guys, I know I, it's been a minute It's been a minute because life has been happening Yeah, so today's video as you can already tell from the title is going to be a life update I'm going to like be sharing with you guys what's been going on what i'm gonna be posting why i'm just posting my first video and it's February. I know. before we get into this video if you're just seeing this face for the very first time i know you might be wondering who's this person hi my name is lillian you're welcome to my channel thank you for clicking on my video and if you're a returning subscriber you are absolutely welcome as well thank you for always coming back so guys let's get into Okay, so guys, last year was really something. Like, last year was really a blessing to me. I can see that. My channel did really, really good because I was focusing a lot on consistency. And it came as a shock to me. I was having video ideas from left, right, center. I was really, really, really happy about that. And I can see that I was really consistent last year. So last year was a lot. Last year was a lot. Although a lot happened to me last year at least my channel did well last year so in all of that in all of the chaos and the blessings of last year i wanted to take a break i told myself to take a break like take january as a break to like relax and rewind and like recuperate <laughs> so i took time for my and I have a news that I will share with you guys later on this year probably before my birthday yeah but I took time like that was what I was doing all through last year and this year I can say that I'm done with that and I'm going to be sharing the news with you guys soon but then I wanted to take a break from all of everything that I was going through last year last year was really chaotic for me me like wow a lot was going on a lot was really going on and for many of you that know my daughter just recently joined us from nigeria late last year as well so i'm still trying to like balance everything that you know that a lot of things has to change like yeah so i was still trying to balance a lot of things so last year was really chaotic and it took january to <laughs> so yeah so this year 2022 i have a lot of things planned out for myself i have a lot of goals to look forward to to work on both for myself for my family and for my channel as well so i'm going to list out those goals so it will be like yeah i can hold myself accountable to it and try to keep up with it and also if anyone out there like is looking for a way to like put their should i say life or daily activity i don't know to like put their life in sort of in line in in line in accordance what is the english that i'm looking for yeah you get it you get what i'm trying to say yeah so we can pick one or two things from this course and take for yourself so yeah let's get into that <laughs> So I have these goals split into two. So number one is my personal goals. And for that one, uh, firstly, I want to build up my relationship with God. I really, really work on my relationship with God. I really want to take that personal this year. So that's number one. Number two, I have to work on my weight. It's not like I'm fat. I'm not really fat, but I want to work on my weight, especially my tummy this year. Number three, I want to like create a daily routine for myself 
to be more productive get it get it. i just don't want to just wake up and just live the life as it goes no that doesn't really work for me these days so i really want to take the time to create a daily routine for myself so yeah so on the part of working on my relationship with god i think that goes hand in hand with my daily routine so this is what i want to be doing okay the first thing i do when i wake up in the morning by seven is to come downstairs for my morning prayers and that finishes by eight and when it finish i make breakfast drink my tummy tea and then i go back upstairs have my bath you know what I have <laughs> and come back downstairs to have my breakfast and I resume my day and then I will be going to the gym three times in a week so I think I'll be going to the gym Monday Wednesdays and Fridays so Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays I'll be going to the gym every week so that's part of it so if it's monday by 12 i'll go to the gym and come back and then, yeah so for my night time if i go to bed after dinner i have my bath and then i go to the room i get my journal this is a new thing that i just introduced into my daily routine i jot down let me just show you guys what i do so i'll put it in the screen so you guys can see what i'm talking about better so i I have this is the genre. <laughs> Pink and nice. So uh it's just um, it's just a book, nothing too serious. I'm starting with a book, but I know with time I'll get a proper daily journal or planner. Yeah. So I start with a Bible passage. With this here, I have a Bible app on my phone that I use to get daily Bible Bible passages. So it's just a Bible app. Just search if you <clears throat> if you're interested, you can just search for any Bible app and yeah, you get it definitely. So what I do, I start by writing Bible passages of the day. I get the daily passage from the Bible app. I write it down. I read it through and I try to pick the message of the day. And then I open from a guest open you know what that is like i get the bible and i like i keep calm and i try to just open any passage of the bible and read the whole chapter so yes. like for this day it was nehemiah chapter 8 verse 1 to the end it always has to go to the end and then i read it through and pick like three chapters that really really sits with me like three chapters that get in that has a message I try to pick out a message from every passage that I open. So, like uh, three chapters that has a message for me, I write it down. So that's what I do for the first paragraph. The second one, I try to list out everything that I'm thankful for for that day. That's why I do this at the end of the day. So for the whole day, all I was thankful for, all I'm thankful for, I write it out as many as it can be. And then the the last thing on this to be my prayer request <laughs> so for that day i will write out prayer requests that came to my mind it's like from during the day all that happened is there anything that i want to pray to god about is it about a friend is it about a family member any prayer request that came to me throughout that day i write it down and i pray about it and then I sleep so that's how I end up and the next day I wake up again go for prayers do it all over again so that's like for my daily routine guys secondly my youtube goals so for my youtube goals I have been taking the month of January to really go through my videos look at what I need to work on what do I need to cut out what do I need to like put on hold because there are some videos that I do that they're not really too working well so I look at them and I'm like what do I need to do? Do I need to cut this out? Do I need to like 
quote unquote on this work on other stuff and probably this and all that to it so that's what i've been doing i've been watching videos online as well i've been researching on a lot of things because this year i really want to work smart and not because i was consistent the whole of last year and i really saw the improvement i saw the results but this year i'm going to focus more on working smart than just being consistent yes i know consistency is is fine it's the best it's good it works but then i want to post quality videos more quality than quantity that is what i'm going to be focused on this year so yeah i've been really working on that a lot lately and i've been searching for other ways where i can make videos on that has value i don't know if you get what i mean make other ways that i can improve my channel other videos that i can work on that i can do that what's the word that i'm looking for <laughs> you get what i mean you get what i mean yeah so there's this series that i'm going to start on my youtube channel because i've been really i've been researching a lot on it and i think that probably it will work i don't know guys i need your i really need your opinion on this so i'm thinking of starting to make a video starting to make videos about the uk how to come to the uk what to do how to get visa and all of those things so i need your opinion in the comment section let me know in the comment section if that would be a good idea if that if you would really want to see that if that yeah yeah if that would be of value to you so that's what i'm saying i'm looking for video ideas that would be of value to my viewers yeah session better video ideas to provide for you guys english is not my strong suit just cope with me i hope you get what i'm trying to say <laughs> yeah so that's so that's that another thing is while i've been going on youtube to research for different ways to work on my channel i've been looking at my videos as well and i've been seeing that i really need to i feel like i feel like i need to open a separate channel for my breakfast with me and all that and that will be like cook with me so that would be mainly for cooking i don't know since i'm not a i'm not a caterer <laughs> so i don't know like i don't know if i should do that or if i should just keep it on this channel and continue doing it on this channel i don't know but one thing i know for sure is i'm definitely going to start sewing again this year fully yeah because as a lot of you know or some of you know i was sewing when i was in south africa and then i had to put a stop to it like a pause let's not say stop i had to put a pause to it because the relocation to this place so now that i'm done with every other thing that i was doing i think i can now start sewing food so yeah that's by the way and then i'm thinking of opening a separate youtube channel for that where we sew together probably teach how to sew one or two things i don't know but i know that i'm trying to do that part so that is a separate channel that was why i was thinking if i should make that breakfast with me a separate channel so i don't know guys let me know in the comment section what do you think should i make it a separate channel or continue putting it on this channel because the new idea of videos on how to come to the uk just let me know so well. don't worry guys i'll still be doing vlogs i'll still be doing my normal videos that i'm doing i'll still be doing self-care on a budget self-care on a budget i'm going to take it actually really serious this year with good hairstyles and good nail designs and hopefully these hair companies and nail companies will reach out to me and partner with me i don't know let's just speak it into existence because that's part of the dream part of the plan yeah because we actually need to go and start having all this brand endorsement so yeah that's part of it so basically what i'm trying to say in general is i took a break and now i'm back and guys thank you for your support but i can't believe it. it's like ah <laughs> i are like we are in 700 subscribers guys 700 subscribers i started from zero <laughs> oh my god when i'm celebrating my what was i singing <laughs> when 
when I was celebrating my subscriber increase, like I know some people feel like hey, is this small? But I started this from zero subscribers. Do you know what that means? I did not have any crowd to pull from anywhere. Nobody knew me from this world. It's just me myself and my and my camera and my ring light. I'm just basically talking to the phone and the ring lights. And now I have 700 subscribers and 70 videos. When I started, I was there were so many things going through my head like, hmm, who will watch me? Guys, I just got a package. <laughs> my leg wants to break in this sitting down, but it's fine. I just got a package, guys. Guess what is in here? Yes. <laughs> Let's open it and see. So, guys, this is what I got. Guess what this is? A bad money. <laughs> oh my god, they just delivered it. Nice. I hope this is nice. That's by the way. So, guys. <laughs> What was I saying? What did I say? Where did I end before this would distract me? What was I saying? So as I was saying guys, there was a lot of fear when I started Like if you if you screw down and watch my first video, you you understand what I'm saying Like ah, what do I have to say? What do I have to offer? Like would people even bother to watch my videos? Like would they not say mm -hmm. So it's not interesting if that was it <laughs> So there was a lot of fear and now I was even The one that was worse was like what will I even film in this YouTube channel? Like, video ideas to post. But now, nah, look at me. 70 videos. 70 videos, or do you know what it takes to make 70 videos? Se oh my God. I still have a lot of ideas spinning through my head. Don't worry, guys. This year, we are going to give you back to back quality videos. Fingers crossed. <laughs> so, yeah, that's it. Thank you all for your support. I see it. I see it. Like, I'm not going to lie. I did see ya. Thank you so much. I am so grateful. I'm so happy. Thank you for your support. Please don't, don't stop. Continue to support your girl, please. Because I know that it, I did not even say that my YouTube goal was to grow and get to more than a thousand and get monetized. Yes, get monetized. That's very important. <laughs> to go and get monetized. I know that this year for sure. We're already in 700. What's remaining? 300. I trust you guys. You can do that for me, right? <laughs> all right guys so thank you for watching this video please don't forget to continue supporting your girl hit that subscribe button if you haven't like and share don't forget to always comment in my videos please guys comment that really does help like and comment leave a comment leave one leave two leave three you can leave as many comments as you want to that really helps my video to get to people when you engage with the video so like please comment and share emphasis on the share share to your family friends and loved ones thank you bye i'll see you in my next video Mwah.